Hey guys, welcome back. And today we're gonna to talk about my top five tips to create your best bedroom. So guys, I've literally designed thousands of bedrooms because I've been a hospitality designer for years. So I know those kind of top five things that you need to make sure you have to make sure that your bedroom is restful, calming, and a place you can rejuvenate yourself. So the number one thing that you want to make sure you do is you create a calming, restful, recessive color palette. Mm -hmm. Things like neutrals, soft roses. Blues are really fabulous right now and blue is a good color to sleep in. Blues and greens. Think of warm whites. All of those tones, all of these colors that we're kind of showing here, this will be a really, really important step. So it's number one for me. So the number two item is really important as well and it's your overall lighting. And I say that because it's a room where you're going to sleep. So you want to make sure that you have control of your lighting. You want your lighting to be warm. You want it to all be on dimmers. And it's best if you have an element that you can also control right from the bed so that you don't have to get up to close your lights as you're getting ready to go to bed. And most bedrooms have either a window or sliding doors or something. So what you want to make sure is that you have handled your window treatments for that space because you want to be able to either black it out completely or at least room darken so that you get plenty of darkness while you're trying to sleep. Now there's lots of ways to do this. And if you've seen this video on lighting that I did, that kind of goes in depth on how to cobble together dimmers, how to make sure that all of these details get handled. If these tips are making a big difference for you guys, please thumbs up, you know, comment down below, like me, subscribe, all that stuff. The third element that you want to have is textural layers. And that's because we want it to be inviting, we want it to be calm, and we want it to be restful. So the way you achieve that is start with things like make sure you have good soft sheets. I personally like Supima cotton ones if you can get them. Have multiple layers of blankets, maybe a lightweight cotton one, maybe a duvet of some kind, either down or down substitute. You can also throw a little throw or a lap blanket on the top if you just want to catch a quick nap in the afternoon. Another important thing is to have carpets underfoot. Now, many bedrooms are wall to wall, so you're covered there. But if you're not and you have a hard surface, make sure you check out this video on rugs and that'll show you how to make sure you've got the right rug for your bedroom. And then the last thing you wanna have is, like I mentioned, a throw or some accessory pillows that just kind of make you feel cozy and crunchy and you can just kind of like hang out in the space in the afternoon if you wanna take a nap. So the fourth item that you wanna take care of in your bedroom is no clutter. Bedrooms are a no clutter zone. So what you need in there is you need functional furniture and storage. Bedrooms should feel clean, calm, simple, restful to the eye. And you wanna make sure that you do that by being able to put things away. So there's lots of good storage solutions that we've talked about before. And if you need some good storage ideas, you can check out my Ikea video that I did a couple of weeks ago that goes into it in depth. So lastly, and it's a little unexpected, but it's something that really reinforces the energetics of the space because you want your bedroom to feel like a spa retreat. You want it to feel calming. You want it to feel like that place that you can go to, to cocoon. And to do that, you need to bring in a little nature. So I'm not great with plants, but this is a great location for a plant is in your bedroom. You can do shells, you can do running water, even fresh flowers. All of those are good things that are reminders of the natural environment, which is very calming and restful to us as humans. And it kind of quiets down our energetics a bit. So make sure you've got those five elements included when you're starting to design your bedroom. Now thanks to all my new subs 
And if you want me placed on my email list, be sure to go over to hello at lisaholt.com. Just drop me a quick hi and I'll make sure you're on that list. And listen, guys, I love it. Stay safe. Be sure and comment, ring the bell, subscribe, share, be safe. And I'll see you guys next week.